My name is Ramesh Patel and I'm president uh, of CETA for Asia Pacific. Uh, so we support all the airlines, airports and government uh, in Asia Pacific. And, uh, we are focused on three key areas of impact. The first uh, being the economic pressure. With the grounding of fleets, uh, how the industry will drive the operational cost efficiencies and making the most of their assets. It's not that they were not you know, making the most of their assets before COVID-19, but now they will have to stress their assets even more. Second, safety and security. So when we talk about safety and security, previously it focused on aircraft and safety procedures. After 9-11, anti-terrorism kicked in. And now post-COVID, I would say, will we'll help be added as a necessary measure at the borders. And third area which uh, we are focusing on is sustainability. Will the demand of cleaner skies intensify? It is likely that uh, you know, we may see the shift to leisure travel and the business move to more digital solutions. Basically, the recovery and the eventual resurgence of the industry is dependent on technology adoption, new ways uh, and the new processes, and over and above, higher level of collaboration between the air transport industry players. And I would say those being airlines, airport, governments, industry bodies, they will need to really work together to really gain the confidence back for the passenger to fly again. And no one can predict uh, you know, the, how, how the airports will look five years down the road as things are still evolving. But clearly, the airports will look quite different than what they are today. Uh, Asia Pacific is the region uh, first impacted by COVID-19 and also the first witnessing some gradual easing of internal borders. And of course, introdu introduction of the domestic travel in the markets such as uh, Vietnam, South Korea, China, Indonesia. Among the big trends uh, that are going to emerge in the post-COVID-19 world, uh, we feel that uh, higher usage of mobile, your own personal device, uh, artificial intelligence, uh, biometrics, personal data protection uh, are going to be the key driver of the changes in the new airports and, and, and five years down the line. Our industry is seeing an increased interest uh, to adopt uh, the digital solution, but we do expect a different rate of adoption across countries and the region. And this is mainly uh, due to the different government and border policies.